Hello world, welcome back to another Pico Gym workout exercise video. In this video, we'll be walking through the general skills challenge collaborative development. Let's get into it. My team has been working very hard on new features for our flag printing program. I wonder how they'll work together. You can download the challenge files here, challenge.zip. I already have them over here, so let's go ahead and navigate into the challenge directory itself. And it happens to be another Git challenge for us to solve. So let's go ahead and cat out that flag.py and see if that has anything for us. It just says printing the flag. If we do git log, it just shows one log of where it initializes the flag printer, which is just this print statement, it seems. And then we can do git show. And it doesn't show us much of anything when we do that. So how can we get some more information? Well, what we can do is actually navigate into the Git directory itself. And we're going to want to take a look at the logs directory. And what we want to do is open this head file up in a text editor. And we can see a bunch of commit history. Now, this is important because when we're looking at this, right, we can see the different commits that took place. It's a lot more detailed than what we were looking at before. And what we can actually do is we can use git show to show the changes at each of these commits. So we have a part one, part two, and part three here. The initial flag printer is going to be this commit message right here, not the zero, but this commit right here. So we know not to look at that one because we know what that one is. So we want to look at these three other ones instead. So let's take a look at the one that begins with zero here first. And we'll do git show. And then you're just going to paste the commit message ID right there. And we can actually see the first part of our flag, Pico CTF teamwork. So now we want to do that for each of the other two commit objects. So here's one that begins with seven. We'll copy that and we'll do the same thing we did before. Git show, then the commit message ID. Then we have the second part of the flag. And then we want to do that with the third part right here. The one that begins with an eight. Git show, third part right there. And then there's the rest of the flag. So what we can do is just kind of copy and paste those into the terminal here to compose the entire flag. And our flag ends up being teamwork makes the dream work. So we'll copy that, paste it in, and submit. All right, if you enjoyed the video, drop a like and subscribe to the channel to show your support. Turn on post notifications to get regular injections of cyber content directly into your feed. Check out our Patreon, join our Discord, and follow us on Twitter. Links in the description box down below. And leave any feedback or questions in the comments section down below. This is Almond Milk. Thanks for watching. Goodbye, world.